Hey, good morning everybody. It's Christmas Eve. All right, so last night I didn't sleep one bit because I decided to have one scoop, one little scoop of my favorite ice cream that contains caffeine. I tossed and I turned and finally I gave up and I just turned on the TV in my bedroom. And then I finally shut that TV off at 2.30 in the morning. So anyways, right now, I gotta go to the supermarket because they close early on Christmas Eve, okay? And I'm all out of water. Within one month, I went through two cases of water. One case holds 24 bottles of water. So that's 48 bottles of water in one month. Like I said, I use these for uh, making my, uh, my favorite drink, which is raspberry iced tea, and also coffee and tea. I don't use tap water. I don't trust tap water for anything. So anyways, before I continue, I want to say thank you to all of my subscribers and also those new people who are visiting for the first time. If you guys find something that resonates with you and a simple life uh, really attracts you, then please consider on subscribing to my channel. We'll be right back with more. I'm not suggesting anything so complicated. A new place, a new home, for a while, let me feel alive. Nothing to hold me back, take my time, just enjoy the ride. A new man, passing by, life is good, best I've ever felt. suspect that the supermarket are gonna be flooded with people because I'm not the only one that's trying to get it that's trying to get there to get what they need because they're gonna close early but there's gonna be potentially thousands of people in this area this town and neighboring towns that are doing the same thing they want to get out of their home go out there pick up those things that they need for the holidays before the store closes after all, the employees, they have things to do too, like dinners and parties and celebrations, cooking and drinking. Yep. I'm not a drinker, guys. I'm very simple, very plain, in case you haven't noticed. So this morning I did text my brother to wish him and his family a safe Christmas and a safe holidays and uh, it's a nice day and it's a little bit warm in my car you know I think I must have said this like a million times in the past I've been living in Florida for um, 23 years and Florida does not feel very Christmassy. I grew up in northeastern Massachusetts and since childhood I associated snow with Christmas. And I've been here 23 years and every single year of those 23 years has never really felt like Christmas. It's just the way it is. You go outside and everything is green and the sun's out. Uh, people are not all uh, wrapped up in warm clothing and scarves, you know. Look how I'm dressed. I'm going to the supermarket like this. If I was back in Massachusetts, 
I'd have gloves on, maybe boots on or something, a hat, earmuffs, you know. Here, no. look, there's a truck over there with a four-wheeler in the back. <laughs> and there are convertibles driving around. And it's 73 degrees out right now. And uh, yeah, it's not visually Christmas as we know it in most part of the country, okay? The trees are green, the leaves are green. There's a couple of brown trees with no leaves, you know, but not many. And this part of town where I live, north of Tampa, there isn't a whole lot of palm trees either. So, yeah. But I like it. I like it. I, I love dressing comfortable year round. You know? But uh, I'll see so you guys. anyways, for the past three days, I have not been having any breakfast and I'm not having any lunch. I'm skipping breakfast and lunch. I had a cup of coffee for breakfast and my pills. And uh, I'm gonna eat something about four o'clock and then that's it. Because as stated in my last video, I have to lose weight. Um, I think I gained about 20 pounds the past couple of years and I have to take it off. And I have a bad habit and the bad habit is when I got nice snacks at home, I don't know when to start eating. I, I don't know when to stop eating it, okay? Um, like I had a couple of planters peanuts that was on sale at the supermarket. You buy one, get one free. Well, guess what? Both cans are done. I totally demolished it. I demolished it. That's not a good thing to do. I really need to practice moderation. Moderation to me is non-existent, okay? At least I'm beginning to practice it with ice cream. I don't want to punish myself and not eat things I don't, that I love, okay? I have to learn moderation. I, I need to know that I can still eat the things I love but it's within moderation. It's when I don't recognize that is when I get in trouble. A couple nights ago, I went to bed and I was totally, totally bloated. I felt like somebody forced fed me until I couldn't eat anymore. Nobody did that. I did it to myself. So I'm all done with my very, very, very small grocery shopping. There's a few things I needed to get. I only had one coffee cup left for my Keurig machine. So I came in, I got another 10 pack and I got uh, one more pack of salmon burger because I love salmon burger. I'm gonna have that for supper later on with salad and I got one pack of banana nut bread. I have not had banana nut bread in a long time, guys. So I might have that for dessert later on with maybe a half a scoop or a scoop of ice cream, just being honest. And I got some coffee creamer, flavored coffee creamer for my coffee. I've been using regular 2% uh, milk for my coffee. And it doesn't taste good, it tastes horrible, but I've just been tolerating it. So of course my coffee um, flavor is from Dunkin' Donuts French Vanilla Coffee. Well, my coffee cream is French Vanilla. It'll taste better that way. And what else did I get? Oh, that's right. I got about, I got two 24 packs of water 
because I was all out. That's what I use for my coffee and that's what I use to make my beverage. So now I'm gonna go home and put these things in and then I'm gonna come back to this area here downtown and just go for a nice little walk. You know, burn some calories. Last night, I went for a walk around the community. I did two laps, which was good. When I get out of work, I get home about 5.30, okay? I've been doing that for the past two months, okay? And I could have gone for a walk or a bike ride after work, but what do I do? It's a bad habit. I come home, I slouch on the couch, and I snack. This is how my life's been for a while and it needs to change. It's gonna be a new year coming up and I wanna do things different. I don't wanna go and start doing the same old, same old and get stagnant and then procrastinate and then complain about my own weight and the crap that I eat. I have to practice moderation this year if I'm if I'm gonna lose any weight, okay? So that's all I wanna say. It's holidays and um, I feel pretty good today. Even though I didn't get enough sleep last night, I feel fine, I feel fine. I think I'm re-energized from the cup of coffee I had this morning to tell you the truth. So anyways, I'll see you guys pretty soon.
right guys so um after i took all the groceries in the house i came downtown and i just wanted to go for a nice walk on christmas eve i enjoy going to the antique shop as you guys know i did go to a local antique shop here i saw a couple of interesting things but of course i'm not spending money right now i did purchase many many things the last couple of months since i moved into my new home so I'm watching my spending right now. Um, so I'm going to go home. I'm going to hunker down. I'm going to relax. Try to find a good movie. Get comfortable. And that's going to be my Christmas Eve. Um, this evening I'm going to have some nice salmon burger with salad. And maybe a light dessert. And... Uh, just kind of chill out and once again I wish you guys a merry merry Christmas be safe until I see you guys again maybe New Year's Eve we'll see see you guys later Looks like we're going to get a little bit of rain. 